Okay, the last question from the sister. It's following something we spoke about before, the 99 names of Allah, the names of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. She says that I have a regular practice. I bring my children in the morning together and we recite the 99 names of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala together. Um, she says, after seeing your program, I'm a bit confused. Uh, is this something for me to do, something good for me to do, Shia? Okay. Some people misunderstand the concept of utilizing the names of Allah the Almighty as a mean of worship. Mm-hmm. While the verse is very clear, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, وَلِلَّهِ الْأَسْمَاءُ الْحُسْنَى فَدُعُوهُ بِهَا وَذَرُوا الَّذِينَ يُلْحِدُونَ فِي أَسْمَاءِ So the meaning of that is to invoke Allah through His beautiful names. And we repeatedly mentioned the hadith of removing al-ham wal-gham, uh, the distress and the worries. اللهم إني أسألك بكل اسم هو لك سميت به نفسك etc mm-hmm. to the end of the hadith which is collected by Imam Ahmad. So the meaning of using the names of Allah subhanahu wa taala as a ibadah is to invoke Him through His names. For instance, say for instance, uh, you may say, Allahum maghfir li warhamni, which means, Oh Allah, forgive me my sins and have mercy on me. Mm-hmm. And you're calling on whom? Allah. And amongst His names is Al Ghafur. And Ar Rahim, the of forgiving and the most merciful. So using these two names in this occasion suits the dua most. So you should say, Allahumma ghfirli wa rahamni, inna ka anta al ghafur al rahim. Allahumma hdini fa inna hu la yahdi illa ant. Oh Allah guide me, no one guides but you. Hmm. And so on. Oh Allah provide me. Uh, from your bounties, إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ الْغَنِيُّ الْكَرِيمُ You are the all rich, the all generous. Mm-hmm. That is the meaning of using the names of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. What some people do uh, by sitting and quoting all the names of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, may Allah bless you for that. But this is not a practice which is prescribed to be done in the morning or in the evening for a specific virtue. Jazakallah